peer-to-peer -peer connection that they develop um, immediately is is something that I think is 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 really worth um, the, the switch, right? If if so, if you're a school who's or if you're a class who's going in the spring, I, I mean, for me personally, I I I would never want to go in the spring only because with those sixth graders, I want to make an impact immediately so that throughout the rest of the school year for, you know, five to six or seven months later, uh, they're still talking about what happened at outdoor school and they're still talking about how much fun that was. And um, so I, I think that in allowing them to go to that program early in the year is, is, is just going to benefit them even more. Across the state, teachers are talking about the benefits of fall outdoor school. A Polk County fifth grade teacher says, this was such a valuable experience for our students and provided an amazing opportunity for students to bond and build a strong community as they embarked upon the rest of the school year as a community. In Washington County, a sixth grade teacher says, our primary goal for going to outdoor school in the fall was to help students connect, communicate, and make new friends. Everything else came secondary to this goal. Many students reported that this was accomplished for them. Clearly, Fall Outdoor School offers a unique opportunity for students to bond and build community with their classmates. But those aren't the only benefits. When students attend outdoor school in the fall, they bring their enthusiasm and excitement for learning back into the classroom, where teachers have many months to take advantage of the momentum. Plus, Teachers and students have an opportunity to see different sides of each other while there is still plenty of time to build deeper relationships. Kids, because so I've gone twice now, right? And each time I'm, you know, we're able to have these almost inside jokes that we were able to develop as we we're there because they can see, hey, here's this teacher who, you know, I've seen him outside of the classroom as well. And so I know he can he can be funny, he he can make jokes, or he um you know, actually knows how to play football, you know, or something interesting where they may not see that with, you know, in the, in the classroom. So um, I, I think for me, I've been able to develop a relationship with a lot of these students much faster than I would if I would have this later in the year. I'm not saying that you wouldn't develop those relationships at all, but I think that, um, but it's definitely more impactful because if we want to really get a grip on some of these students and really get a hold of them and really have them appreciate education, appreciate the outdoors, then we have to have that as soon as possible. So if we can have that in the fall, then it's just going to be, for the, for the most part, in that way, it's going to be smooth sailing in terms of behavioral, in terms of how you teach and the curriculum that you're teaching. So, um, so it, it truly is impactful. And I, and I feel like that was, that's, that's the best choice for our school. And I think that it's benefited the students, I mean, immensely. So. For many schools, attending outdoor school in the fall offers amazing benefits related to student engagement and relationships. Educators also report that fall outdoor school has fewer conflicts with testing schedules, often has better weather, and has more availability and scheduling options with many outdoor school providers. Each year, school districts submit a single funding application for the entire school year. So whether you're planning to attend in fall or spring, you'll submit your application as part of your district's funding application package. If you have any questions about outdoor school funding, please reach out to us at outdoorschool at oregonstate.edu or contact your regional coordinator.